Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to show you a quick location where you can make right about close to $40 to $50 each trip. It's just right outside of Strawberry, about maybe about a minute and a half, two minutes tops. Um, each location, you're going to be able to get at least 10 salmon, and you'll also be able to get a cougar between two star and three star. Majority of the time, it's three star as long as you get your shot good. Now also too, I just want to give a shout out to a guy named Dean Nuts. He has a channel where he found these salmon and I just want to give him credit and also too, he's trying to get up to 200 subscribers. So down in the description will be a link to his channel. Try to help the guy out. He seems like a pretty decent guy and he's trying to get to 200 subscribers. So just go over there and subscribe to him and just let him know where you came from, from my channel. So real quick, I'm going to pull up on the map and show you where you need to head to for the first location to get the salmon. Just go ahead and head over here. It's just west, like I said, of Strawberry. It's not a far ride at all. So when you get over to the location, kind of just look at the rock formation right across from me and right behind me, there's a really big tree. So between that and looking at how the way the rocks are laid out, you'll see right where I'm at. And basically you just need to go ahead and head to the shore, pull out your fishing rod. And you'll basically see a lot of the 75 cent to a dollar fish pop up instantly. Uh, down here on the left hand side by these big rocks is where a lot of the salmon will pop up. Usually you'll see at least two to three at a time. Uh, honestly, just use eagle eye, cast around on top of them. They'll catch on really quick. Um, this is probably one of the fastest locations where I see where you can reel them in. Because as soon as you catch them, whatever, they'll start fighting. I just ignore it and just reel them straight in because there's not enough time for them to actually break your line because how shallow the water is here. And as you can see right there, I just pulled him right in with no problem whatsoever. And honestly, I mean, it's like I said, it's probably the quickest one I've seen with salmon. So like, every time you drop it out there on top of them, they're going to catch it really quick. Um, you'll be able to get your 10 salmon really fast here. Now also too, you'll see where Dean actually ran into the water and stuff and he scared the fish up on his shore. You could do that as well and you'll actually make a lot more than 40 or $50 each time because you could get damaged carcasses. So you need to either go ahead and stomp on them or stab them, whatever, so they're lower quality. So you can carry another 10 and lower quality fish. Uh, but you could do that with all the fish that are here. There's a lot of 75 cent, like I said, and dollar fish. You could do that with all of them. I'm going to get ready to head over to show you where you need to get the cougar at. A lot of people know where this location is at though. Now also too, real quick before I cut off, you'll see a lot right here in front of me, there's a salmon actually just beaching themselves. They'll do that a lot of the times. You'll actually probably get two or three of those while you're here because you kind of stir the fish up. You won't even have to catch them. I've been catching at least two or three that just beach themselves. A lot of the small fish will do it as well. So this is a cougar location. Now this is where you actually need to be at to make the shot. Now to do this shot, you need a bolt action rifle. If not, you could actually just sneak up on the cougar, but this is a better way to get a better shot. He'll be right about where this is. And as I ride over here, you'll see this tree to the left. And then you'll also see two of these small broken trees. That's where you know the right location to make the shot. So as soon as you're lined up right about there, go ahead and pull out the bolt action rifle and use the scope. And you'll see him poke his head up a little bit. Try to, I think I caught his back a little bit there. So it's probably going to be a poor uh, quality one uh, just because of that. I kind of rushed it. But if you get a good head shot, he'll be a three star every time. Well, I would say nine times out of ten he will be. You know, sometimes now this one probably would have been a two star anyway. Because I've noticed a lot of times with the ones that have the white coat, they're two star. They're never three stars. So yeah, I mean honestly, it's a really great location with the salmon and the cougar itself. Also up and down this stream, you'll see elk. And on your way back, there's actually a really big lake to the right hand side on your way back. There's a lot of elk that are there as well. Um, there's a lot of wildlife in the area, but like I said, I'm using this as a base example of what you can get every time if this is all you want to focus on. So it's a pretty quick 40 to $50 every time. And like I said, you probably can get closer up to 70 or $80 if you get poor quality fish. We're gonna head to the butcher real quick and I'll show you what I made on this quick trip real fast. Like I said, I only got the salmon and only got the cougar. And I think I picked up a couple extra little fish while I was there, just cause they kind of beached theirself. So you can see you got $3 for the cougar meat, just 75 cent for that fish, two, uh, $25 for the salmon, a dollar for the cougar fangs, uh, just a dollar for a chain pickerel, just because he was there. Two dollars for the rock bass, two dollars for the pelt, and two dollars and seventy cents for the carcass. So if this video helped you out, I'd appreciate it if you'd like it, share it with your friends. Also to subscribe, click the notification bell, so as soon as I have videos come out, you get notified right away. As always guys, I'll catch you next time in the next video.